So this is one of the classrooms? Yeah, this is one of the classrooms. Wow, that's got a great view. I never had a school <laughs> with a view that good. Wow. Yeah, I wish my son went to a school like this right? one in Barcelona. I don't think... Well, but you can see how poor the area is. And there are many houses that are that are that seem like they're, they're about to fall at any second you know fall apart and before there wasn't any even services up here right there was no electricity no plumbing no electricity stuff, right? no plumbing no no potable water it was just mud there were no um, real paved roads those are one of the challenges that we face um, when we work in areas that have been abandoned for so many years by the local government you know uh, you know how to get the kids safely to school how to you know, transportation issues right. educating poses so many challenges that's why it's so important that uh, the education that is offered is integral it is it should be comprehensive you know it should be planned um, in a way that it embraces all of those challenges and is the focus of the community which is what you're trying to do right? yeah yeah like this is really the center of Point of the neighborhood in a lot of ways. Exactly. Yeah. This is this is the this is gonna be like the the, the core of this of this area, and, and we hope that the school serves as a community center as well, so the community, the entire community, can thrive. And and and, and this is the real transformational power of education, I think. When when you build an infrastructure like this, that is not only walls and 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 metal and glass it is it is it is a space a safe space a safe haven for kids to to play to feel protected to be uh, to be taken care of 